This afternoon, I was sent by the office of the ED, the executive director of the National Council for Education, uh, to come and deliver to King Caesar University the charter. And to that note, I hereby hand over the charter to the Vice Chancellor of King Caesar University. This charter gives our students the capacity now to do masters in any institution in the world, including Makerere and all other, all other you know, universities in the world. Now they are able to do their postgraduate studies. Yeah, what is unique here? The unique here is training, the way we train our students. Uh, for example, I will take example of medicine. We chose to train our medical students looking at each hospital institution that has a specialization. We don't train in one hospital. For example, when the students uh, start their clinicals, if we are to train them in OBS and GAIN, they must go to Kawempe National Referral Hospital because Kawempe is one of these hospitals in this country that trains very, very well uh, in the subject of obstetrics and gynecology. Before COVID, they were delivering over, uh, I think, a million children in a year, which means the student has a chance to have a case. Uh, to study. We train also our students in Morocco on the subject of surgery uh, and uh, pediatrics because Morocco is the best on surgery and the pediatrics. We also train our students in Kirudu on internal medicine because Kirudu is the best in this country in internal medicine. So we did not go for one hospital. We are going for various institutions of health care where they excel in a given uh, uh, specialization and our students train there. We are taking our students for uh, uh, community health and uh, you know community health in other centers like Ma Masaka Regional Hospital. Uh, Kayunga, Lugazi, then further and other hospitals up country. That's what makes King Caesar unique. We don't train from one hospital. We train our students in various hospitals. Then we have here a, a very unique issue. We don't compromise on lecturers. We are trying to get the best. If you see the lecturers who have seen here, the professors, one of the professors of law is a graduate of Harvard and uh, Oxford. That combination, you cannot get it in most places. Someone who is having a, a, a PhD from Harvard and a master's from Oxford. We are very uh, specific when we are choosing our human resource. That is a very important issue. Then, of course, the other issue, we have started, uh, we've been equipping our labs. Our labs are very good. I don't know whether the pharmacology lab uh, technologist is here. Can you call him for me? Because we are now developing medicines here. We have medicines here we have developed. Can someone look for me, the technologist, he tell us a few, two examples of the medicine we are developing in our lab here at King Caesar University. We have very strong labs. And this charter means further investment. I'm now going to invest about $2 million in the labs because this has been delaying me. We must strengthen our labs and uh, then our students can do proper research. Our lecturers can do proper research. The other issue we are doing capacity building, we have now about to 12 students who are studying PhDs, some in the UK, some in Ireland, some in Canada, South Africa. We've also had a, a, an opportunity to partner with many institutions across the globe. We are having a lot of partnership with many institutions. Uh, I think the management will list all the institutions we are partnering with, both inside Uganda and outside Uganda, 
and then they produce the list. But also we are changing. We are changing our education to practical courses, whereby students will be doing two years here. Uh, if a course is for four years, the other two years in the field. You study, you go in the field, you study. While working in the field, you come back like that. We want a practical course, and uh, we are going to concentrate on skilled subjects, like medicine, like engineering. These are the courses we love most because they empower the students. Mm.